Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel Cracking Maths with Shufia and today we are going to start sums on decimals. As all the terms related to decimals along with the place value, representation or number line etc. I have already described in video 3 of fractions and decimals the link of which I have given in my description box for those who are new to my channel. You can check it if required. So let's start doing sums on decimals. To compare the decimal numbers, which one is greater, which one is smaller, here I'm going to explain three important ways or steps, whatever you may say, as uh, sometimes using one step we can compare the numbers, but uh, in some cases more than one step might be required for the comparison so here are the steps step one first step is to convert them into like decimals that is decimals having the same number of decimal places in case they are not given like this so let me take an example compare 9.23 and 8.1 okay so now these two numbers are not like decimals as they have not equal number of digits equal number of digits uh, in the right hand side of the decimal point see decimal place of first one is first number is 2 and decimal place of second one is 1 but we can convert these unlike decimals into like decimals just by adding required number of zeros in the extreme right extreme right of the decimal part so uh, this 8.1 can be written as 8.8.1 is equal to 8.10 so you see in uh, both the cases we are getting two as decimal places that means they are now like decimals step number two we will compare whole number parts the numbers having the greater whole number part is greater. For example, let me take an example like 2.569 and 9.2. Now, here you see, just we will concentrate on whole number parts. That means left hand side of this decimal point, here as 9 is greater than 2. Therefore, 9.2 is greater than 2.569. That's it. Step number 3. If the whole number part is equal, in that case, we'll compare the digits starting from the tenths place. If tenths place's digits are equal, then we'll compare the digits in hundreds place and so on. For example, I'll show you. Uh, if I take like 9.23 and 9.3 here whole number parts are equal both are 9 so we will compare next one that means tenths place so in tenths place this one is 3 this one is 2 as 3 is greater than 2 therefore 9.3 is greater than 9.23 uh, let's take another example compare 9.23 and 9.2256 here whole number parts are equal uh, tens places are equal so uh, we are going to compare hundreds place whole number part equal tens place equal now hundreds place here it is 3 here 2 as 3 is greater than 2 therefore 9.23 is greater than 9.2256 okay for uh, understanding properly let's take an example arrange the following decimals in descending order number skater whole number parts equal no hoy ako number skater like decimals no hoy so prathomote ami gutei kita like decimals banailam aru like decimals banabor karone ami ki koribo lagibo exactly Occur extreme right side of zero at Okay, let's start. Moi change Korea so a co moi attack it a click here so to hobo point nine eight and 
this one will be 80 this one will be 8.90 this one is already having two numbers and this one also with two decimal place now you see uh, <clears throat> look at this all numbers having same number of digits in the right hand side of the decimal point that is equal decimal places so now first we'll compare whole number parts and uh, if there is any because here you see no whole number is there and uh, we'll compare uh, we'll take it um, we'll think it as zero as there is no whole number given so this is zero this is nine eight like this so <clears throat> we will compare whole number parts and then we will compare tens place hundreds place like this and uh, so here 9.89 is greater greatest one so i will write 9.80 is the greatest one and next we will get 8 but here you see 8 uh, there are two numbers having 8 is the whole part so next will be we will compare tens place now you see as 9 is greater than 0 9 is greater than 0 therefore 8.90 is greater than 8.03 and uh, next one will be 4.57 obviously because 4 is less than 8 and next one will be 0 so next uh, our uh, the descending order will be like this 9.80 is greater than 8.90 is greater than 8.03 next one is 4.57 and last one is our 0.98 now i am writing original numbers given in the question in this order so our order will be like this 9.8 comma 8.9 comma 8.03 comma uh, 4.57 comma 0.98 this is the final answer okay so this is tips time adding any number of zeros to the extreme right of the decimal part of a decimal number does not alter the value of the decimal number for example if we write like this 6.569 then this is equal to 6.5690 equal to 6.56900 and so on but if we write like this 6.569 is equal to 6.0569 then this is wrong always remember extreme right extreme right of zero at kuriko lagiba so that's all for today and see you in my next video till then Take care of yourself and your families. Bye.